But you know, yeah. I just, I, and I'll be honest. I love collecting amazing people. For lack of a better way to put it, and she is definitely one of those amazing people. So wow. Yeah. 
that's definitely like three of them. takes out the gun, puts it on the table, and he says, we're just not going to agree to that. Maybe you can see things our way. And, uh, and then later that day, like the lawyer comes back to Sean and puts his $10,000 contract for 
a one-time payment of $10,000 in front of Sean, as long as he agrees not to sue. And Sean's like, sure. He was like, I was making like 30, 40,000 at the time, a year at the time. I'll take, I'll take 10 grand. He's like, I have no idea what the hell's going on. I'm just like, holy shit, dude. Yeah, they're, you know, it's, it cracked me up. It cracked me up a lot of what he was, like, what he was talking about and what he experienced. But like, yeah. So he's, he's had a, you know, he's had a good life and all kind of interesting experiences. So, totally crazy. If you ask me. And this was like, you know, several years back. Um, so I can imagine how, it, like, the, the money was insane. Like, like, he was saying, like, the, they had a Christmas party, and I can't remember what club, like, they totally went to, like, they had the entire club. And it was basically, you know, Cristal, Hookers, and Blow. And, like, it was like Michael Jordan shows up, Jay Z shows up, like, all these headliners show up. The next year, it's like the company gives the managers five hundred dollars to have Christmas parties at their or at, at their houses. Like, like, like the music industry like collapsed within the year. So, so yeah, just yeah, I mean, yeah, 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 I mean, yeah. So yeah, and I can imagine LA was a lot of the same line because in Echo, you know, there's echoes of what happens in New York and LA. And, sitting there talking, it's like, yeah, you remember that, did you hear about that shooting that happened at Blah 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 Club, and I'm like, yeah, kind of, he's like, yeah, well, that was like around the corner from where we worked, I'm like, we were like, that was one of the artists we worked with, I'm like, holy shit, I, I, I wish I, I wish I could remember the names, but I've never really been into hip hop, and the name dropping has just never worked with me in the first place, so, so do we try and you know, it took me, it, it's taken me years to remember that my uncle works with. Okay, my uncle works with the guy from. Um, I don't remember now. Uh, I want to say Deep Purple, but that's not it. Purple something maybe. Velvet. Mm, Velvet Underground. Who was the singer from Velvet Underground? That's the one. My uncle. My uncle and Lou Reed. Like he's like. Like, if you want to do anything with Lou Reed, you talk to my uncle. He's, like, the manager of person for Lou Reed. Bye. You see, it's been years. Like, it's been ten years. I still can't remember that my uncle works with fucking Lou Reed. I never met Lou Reed. You know, I'm just like... It's like, I should, you know... There are people who'd be like, Yeah, man, my uncle Lou Reed, blah, blah, blah. Right? My uncle works with this guy that's purple velvet, something underground, something. Eh, no big deal. You know, it's like, I, like it, I, I guess it, things like that have just never, just, no, never met, like, but I, but on the flip side, I'll be just like, dude, my friend Rob, have you seen the shit that he's done? Fucking amazing. What do you mean you don't know Rob? Yeah, yeah. So you I know. Have, even though, so, right, there, there is that. I mean, like, I'll definitely put my friends up when, uh. I think that they need to be when it's relevant to the conversation. I'm like, what do you mean you don't know Rob? How can you not? How can you? Exactly. Everybody knows Rob. Or exactly. So I'm in the heart of Williamsburg. Well, approaching the heart of Williamsburg, I'm more like in this river right now. So. Yeah. You know, for, for, for lack of a better way, I'd like it uh, north, 
North Brick Street, you know. A couple more streets and then I'm going to the heart of Williamsburg. Um, yeah, I'm like Bedford in North Fourth. It's an interesting place, this place. I don't know, I think, have you ever been? You know, I just saw the sign. Rob had to drink here. Yeah. It was Laura who I was thinking was Molly. 